Good evening and welcome to everyone. You join us for this T20 match between Australia and New Zealand. I'm Mike Atherton and alongside me today is Mel Jones, Ali Mitchell, Ian Healy and the irrepressible David Gower. Hi Mike, thanks for that intro. I've been down pitch side to look at the conditions. And it's pretty apparent, even before you take a proper look, that they'll be looking at batting first on this pitch. It's very dry on top, and it could make any run chase later quite difficult. Gorgeous clear weather and no threat of any rain. Thanks, David. Two captains are in the middle. Let's join them for the coin toss. Easy decision for the captain there, batting first in home conditions. Empire signals that we're ready to go. First ball of the innings about to be bowled. Yep. Nice shot off the front foot. First ball of the innings and off the mark. Good return back from the deep. Immediately underway with some runs. The team will be after a positive innings from this batter. A great opportunity to come in and put some runs on the board. Hold on. Yes, bowler! Really good shot there. In the end, a very simple shot. Let's the ball come onto the bat and cuts it away for four. A little short on that occasion. Needs to adjust the length slightly to be just a little fuller. Too short on this pitch, and as we've yes. seen already, it makes it very easy to score. There'll be one run here for them. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Maybe they didn't pick it up. Very late on the shot. Yeah, mate. Exquisitely down the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive. Could have been worth more. Nine runs added in that over. Australia are nine for none. Bolt, the left arm pace bowler, is coming on to bowl from the Paddington end. Drives and misses everything. No runs on that occasion. Got into position nicely just too early on the shot. Couldn't find a gap. Marsh shakes their head. It was there to be hit, but couldn't make the most of it. Waiting. Cuts that off well in the infield. 
just can't seem to get the ball away. That's the third dot. Good catch. Yeah. Out. A trudge back to the pavilion, a disappointing display in the end. For someone with such batting skills, this goes down as a fail. With the fall of that wicket, we have a new batter at the crease. Smith will be looking to make a strong start to their innings. Misses everything. Surely that's got to be called a wide, it's completely out of reach. What a ball! Didn't hit that well. Very late playing that shot. A great over. No runs conceded. A wicket as well. Putting enormous pressure on the batters. Going with spin now. Yeah. Flew away with pace. Brilliant timing. Full and good night. Just leant on that. Didn't have to do much. And got four. You can see how good this pitch can be for batting. You want the player coming forward, but it's a tight margin. Only a touch full and put away. Finds the fielder with that shot. Super shot, that. Right out of the textbook. Off the middle, and it flew to the boundary. Williamson, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. Yeah. They've picked the gap. Perfect timing. Good running. Just finding the gap, and that allows for rotation of the strike and keeping pressure on the bowlers. and precision in that shot. Pushed onto the front foot and presented the full face of the bat. Sodi shouldn't be too worried about that last ball. They've got them playing their shots, just need to tighten their areas now. It mightn't get to the boundary, should at least get a couple. Sometimes it doesn't matter how good a ball is, they'll just get smacked. That sees the completion of the over. A good one too, not many opportunities to score. Bolt from the Paddington end. Hold on. Yep, yep. Great shot through the gap. Perfect timing. Well, that was a really solid shot. Read the length early to get onto the front foot, and that raced away for four. Do they go full? Do they go short? A lot to ponder after the boundary. Yeah, yeah. Ease through the field. There'll be runs here. A little flick of the wrist to get it round the corner for an easy run. Couldn't get it through the field. Just through the shot, too early. Thick 
Quick edge. Misses out there on the short and wide one. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great last ball to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Yep. Well timed, but there's a fielder out there. I, for one, reckon that second run was on, but clearly the batters knew better. Well placed, should get a single. Really race between the wickets after it was clipped away nicely behind square. End of the over, seven runs coming from it. Australia are 33 for one. Straight to the fielder. A little late on that, no run scored. Yes, massive edge. Didn't time it at all, but managed to get it away to the boundary. It can be very disheartening seeing good deliveries smacked around. Sometimes you've just got to accept it and move on. Play. Doesn't beat the infield. Four Australia runs are added are there. Australia are 37 one. for one. Saudi with the ball in hand again. Runs it off the face of the bat, almost behind point. Plenty of chasing to pull this one back. A lovely shot off the back foot. The shorter ball having no joy in getting dispatched for four runs. Tried for something a bit different, the last ball. The captain shouldn't mind that. If they get it right, they might just get the wicket. Struck it nicely, could go to the boundary. That is a master class of batting. Reads the length, gets forward and dispatches that to the boundary. That last ball isn't something you'd want to see a repeat of. You don't want to be giving easy runs away. They certainly don't feel like they've got anything on that, but almost every fielder is asking the question.
That's just outrageous. Back to the sheds, but a good contribution to the team today. It's been a nice knock. Difficult period as they come to the wicket. They'll take plenty of time to set themselves up before facing their first ball. Quick onto that in the infield. Just threw the shot too early. Maxwell gets off the mark. End of a really good over, taking a wicket and really slowing down the scoring rate. New Zealand are now allowed five fielders outside the circle. The right arm medium bowler is coming on to bowl from the Randwick end. Yes! Chance to run two. Just a little bit wide, well picked up. And let the ball do all the work really, just to nudge it down towards third. Yep, yep. Did well just to get it down towards third for some runs. Got forward well and was able to drive the ball. A lovely shot and good running. Good shot. It's found the gap. Not a smart decision, you feel, not to run there. Mustn't have a lot of faith in their partner, if you ask me. Big edge. Where's that going? That's the end of a very good over. Good pressure being put on the batters. Good. Not sure anyone is going to cut that off. It was lovely footwork. A great shot, a glorious shot, actually, to get back and play it like that. Always difficult to focus after what happened last ball. But you just got to stay positive and believe the wicket will come. Yes. Right off the middle of the bat. That was timed very, very well. Great shot. Driven down the ground and flew over the boundary. Consecutive boundaries in this over. I wonder what plans they'll come up with to slow this batting. Oh, 
Not the ideal way of handling that ball. Immaculate timing there. Ball is in. A brilliant throw in from the deep caps off what was a fabulous piece of fielding. Yes. There'll be runs here. That's the over. Australia, 69 for two. Yep, yep. Great shot through the gap. Got forward and was able to drive the ball. Lovely shot, good running. Hold on. A little late on that, no run scored. Yeah. Great shot, at least one on offer. Driven off the front foot, fantastic cricket shot, probably expected more there. Play. Can't get that outside the ring field. Well, not a great delivery, got it full, lucky not to be hit to the boundary. Timed it nicely. They'll look for a couple, you'd think. Well, that was just a little bit wide. Well picked up. Let the ball do all the work, really, to ease it down towards third. Yeah, yeah. Nice shot. Runs possible. End of the over, six Australia off it. Australia, a 75 for two. We've seen good control and spin from this bowler. Looking forward to seeing what they can do here. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. What a yeah! position to set there, a brilliant catch. So that's the third wicket down, not a happy person walking off the field. There's a real feeling of disappointment. Lots of pressure coming into bat. We'll have to wait, though, to face their first ball. Yeah. And again, yeah. see you later. Two wickets on the trot. Another one gone, the fourth wicket is in the bag. A bit of trouble if there was another to fall quickly. We've seen some very good bowling. Coming to the wicket, they'll be looking to play within the V early and expand as they get settled. Wait. 
collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Hit that well off the back foot, but couldn't beat the field. Yes! Nice timing, good batting, won't get to the boundary. There'll be one run here for them. That gets things going, just uh, nice to get settled, start to get your first runs. David, ready to face their first ball. Really needs to settle quickly and see if they can get the ball into the gaps. Well taken, yeah! had a lot of work to do and held on to a great catch. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. It's a long way to walk out here just to walk straight back. They'll just want to get this first one behind them and then push on. Nisham, the right arm medium bowler, is coming into the attack from the Randwick end. Waiting. No runs on that occasion, got into position nicely, just too early on the shot, couldn't find a gap. Drives and misses everything. Inglis shakes their head, it was there to be hit but couldn't make the most of it. Finds the fielder with that shot. Short and wide, did well to get some bat on that. Yep. And with that, they're off the mark. Decisive running might have got them to. Uh, looking back at it, I'd say they'd have made it easily, so in the end, poor running. Yep. They'll get at least one. Great work. Yeah! Held their nerve while the ball was in the air and takes a good catch. Well, this is a fantastic wicket, kept the runs down, really didn't get settled, looked to be in trouble, sadly, for most of the knock. And with that wicket, the new batter will mark their guard. They just need to rotate the strike early on as they get settled. Santner from the Paddington end. Yep. Very quick out there, managing to stop it and preventing four runs. There was absolutely a second on then, being a little bit too risk-averse out in the middle. Yes! Good batting, get an opportunity to score and take it. All up! A couple on offer here. Yes. Great shot through the gap. Perfect timing. That was just a fantastic shot. Let's the ball come onto the bat and cuts it away for four runs.
boundary off the last ball. What's to come off this delivery, I wonder? A well-directed short ball, but sways out of the way. Yes! Ease through the field. There'll be runs here. Got forward and was able to drive the ball. Lovely shot and good running. That's great fielding. That ball was flying. Well, that was another good over. You can see the frustration growing on the batters. Yep. Great shot. Not sure anyone can get round to the vacant third man. Steered away nicely. Let the ball do all the work for them. Nicely played for four. Well placed, should get a single. Exquisitely down the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive. Could have been worth more. This is everything. Nice Had to pull off the big dive to save some certain runs. Did it very well, did the keeper. Wait. That's yeah. gone. Yeah. Couldn't ask for an easier catch. It's the sort of dismissal that sees the momentum swing back to the bowler. Gone, but not for many. New batter comes to the crease. Never an easy time to come in after the fall of a wicket. And they're away and nicely off the mark. Really raced between the wickets after it was clipped away nicely behind square. Seven runs added there. Australia are 94 for seven. Sodi, the right armour, is coming into the attack from the Paddington end. I, for one, reckon that second run was on, but clearly the batters knew better. Yep. 
Yes. You can understand why on that line they thought it was safe to let it straight through to the keeper. Beaten on the drive. Oh, yes. Sodi with a superb delivery. Got them trying to drive but messing everything up. Sodi doing really well to keep the pressure on these two. Another good over of yeah. bowling. Got it behind square on the leg side. Swiveled and pulled away. Didn't get all of it though, I don't think. Yep. Straight to the fielder. Well, that could have ended horribly, but very good fast running between the stumps gets them home. Floated that one up, hit well, but couldn't beat the field. Yep, yep. Into the gap, nice shot. Keepers. Never an extra run on that arm. Great throw back in from the deep. Wow, that's missed a lot. Oh, well Nisham with a superb delivery. Got them trying to drive, but messing everything up. Back go the stumps. Missed the straight ball. As they head back to the pavilion, they'll be wishing they went about this innings a little differently. Not too much to speak of on the scoreboard. Star won't have the pressure of facing up just yet. The nerves will be rattling a bit while they're at the non-striker's end. Huge edge! A wonderful delivery to get the edge. You've got to keep hammering away at that spot time and again. Yep. It mightn't get to the boundary, should at least get a couple. Got forward well and was able to drive the ball. A lovely shot and good running. Start takes guard. Been in pretty good touch lately. You wouldn't want to let them get away early with some easy boundaries. Yes. That's off the middle of the bat. You can't fault that shot. Nicely played and it was four runs all the way. Tried for something a bit different, the last ball. The captain shouldn't mind that. If they get it right, they might just get the wicket. Yeah. To the keeper. Got to the boundary, last ball, punches it into the gap to get a single. Excellent batting.
big edge. Gee, they're bowling well at the moment. They complete another very good over. They'll push hard, should get back for two. Bowlers! Yeah, yeah. There'll be runs here. for six off the front foot hit it with all the power and elegance of a batter right at the top of their game Williamson I don't think will be too happy with their bowler at the moment Great shot, at least one on offer. Keep us in! Right there. Yep. Nice shot, runs possible. Twelve runs added there. Australia, Australia are 122 for eight. The left arm medium bowler is coming into the attack in the Paddington end. Strays onto leg and glanced it sweetly. Might just get to the boundary rope. Mistimed it completely. Did just enough to get it to the rope. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have been really happy with that last shot. Cummins will be frustrated with that shot. The ball was there to hit, but couldn't find the gap. Yep. Got forward and was able to drive the ball. Lovely shot and good running. Onto the front foot and punched it nicely. Would have hoped to find the rope. Oh. Yeah. It's off the body rather than the bat, but gets through for one.
Bowler is confident on this one. Saudi coming on, obviously hoping the pace will cause some trouble. Head over the ball, great shot, that's racing away. Yes, keeper, keeper! A brilliant throw in from the deep, caps off what was a fabulous piece of fielding. Timed it nicely. They'll look for a couple, you'd think. Yes, keeper! Good return, back from the deep. A little flick of the wrist to get it round the corner for an easy run. Yes. Ball up. Finds the fielder with that shot. No runs on that occasion. Got into position nicely just too early on the shot. Couldn't find a gap. Ten runs added in that over. Australia are 140 for eight. Bolt to wrap up the innings. Yep. Beautifully played through the leg side off the back foot. The fielder could only pick that up off the boundary rope. Punched that away through the covers with exquisite timing. That last ball isn't something you'd want to see a repeat of. You don't want to be giving easy runs away. Yep. Immaculate timing there. A juicy delivery like that on leg stump isn't going to be missed by this batter. They just put it away. It's been a great over so far. Two boundaries from it. Runs coming very easily. Oy! Oh, yeah, it's nice ball. A little late on that, no run scored. Yep. Nice timing, good batting, won't get to the boundary. They'll get at least one. There'll be one run here for them. Decisive running might have gotten two. Uh, looking back at it, I'd say they'd have made it easily. So in the end, poor running. Drives and misses everything. That's wild. Nothing elegant about that shot. Just not timing it at all. It's poor play. That's the over. Australia are 151 for eight.
And that's the end of the innings. Australia have set a target of 152 runs. There's a lot of time to get these runs. It's a fairly decent total, plenty of options. Don't need to do anything flashy. Just get themselves in and build the run rate. Yes. Edged away first ball. And they'll pick up some runs here. Didn't time it at all, but managed to get it away to the boundary. Always difficult to focus after what happened last ball, but you just got to stay positive and believe the wicket will come. Yeah, yeah. If that had been thrown to the other end, I think you'd be looking at another wicket for sure. Exquisitely down the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive, could have been worth more. Conway is new to the crease. They'll be keen to field bat on ball early on. Yes! Couldn't get it through the field. Immediately underway with some runs. They'd look for a couple here. Bola. A couple on offer here. Right. Easy catch. Yay! Didn't have to move, really. It's been a poor innings under pressure, and now they've got the key batter out cheaply. A new batter always likes to feel bat on ball early on as they bring a bit of energy to the crease. Agar, the left arm orthodox bowler, is coming into the attack from the Paddington end. White. Quick onto that in the infield. Change to the complexion of this match. Got to get the new batter coming forward early, encouraging them to drive yes. and really attack the stumps. Well placed, should get a single. And with that, they're off the mark. Doesn't beat the infield. Could be close. Yes, yes. Gone. Brilliant in the field.
Well, they lose the second wicket. It's a long way back to the sheds. And you can tell they're not happy with that dismissal. The field will come up now, you'd think. Pressure should definitely be on the new batter, who strides to the middle. They'll be looking for another quick wicket. Straight to the fielder. End of the over, three runs coming from it. New Zealand are 13 for two. Richardson in the Randwick end. Yes. Good return there, back from the deep. That shot allows them to get off the mark. Good return back from the deep. Driven off the front foot. Fantastic cricket shot. Probably expected more there. Yep. Ease through the field. There'll be runs here. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. A little late on that. No runs scored. Hit that well off the back foot, but couldn't beat the field. Eight runs added there. New Zealand are 21 for two. Yeah, yeah. Great timing, right off the meat of the bat. Just perfection, a majestic shot. You just cannot hit it any better than that. Raced away to the boundary. Boundary off the last ball. What's to come off this delivery, I wonder? Waiting. Can't get that outside the ring field. Yes. Very sweet off the bat and four all the way. It was wide and suitably dealt with. Agar shouldn't be too worried about that last ball. They've got them playing their shots, just need to tighten their areas now. Yep. Good bit of timing there. One of those ones where you really have to make sure you watch it all the way onto the bat. Picked up the slower one nicely. Back-to-back -back boundaries. The bowler will be searching for something now. Just a dot ball or two to settle things down. Right there. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Short and wide, did well to get some bat on that. A brilliant over for the batting side, not so for the bowlers. Stark, the left armour, is the new bowler in the Randwick end.
Fighting. Wait. Hit that well off the back foot, but couldn't beat the field. Wait. Just threw the shot too early. the edge. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great last ball to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Misses out there on the short and wide one. Nicked it. End of the over, six dot balls, just a masterclass of bowling. The right arm pace bowler is coming into the attack in the Paddington end. Comfortable single if they take it. Turning down runs that are that safe isn't intelligent play in my book. They should be rotating the strike. Yeah, yeah. Great shot. At least one on offer. gone all the way, right out of the middle. Wow! Power off the front foot goes all the way. Phillips has got the big shot away this over. Now they can focus on playing the next ball on its merits. Yes. Great shot through the gap. Perfect timing. Right out of the textbook, off the middle, and it flew to the boundary. Boundaries are flowing. They need to find a dot ball or two to slow things down again. That races away to the boundary. A beautiful shot off the front foot. Just textbook stuff. I'd like to see them aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. We've reached the end of the fielding restrictions. There'll be changes to the field, I imagine. The captain can push this field a bit deeper now. Three more players able to go outside the circle.
White. Didn't hit that well. Very late playing that shot. Yes. Nice shot. Runs possible. Close to the ground. Well, the end of a productive innings. It didn't quite ignite into the fireworks as we would have hoped, but still, solid work. With the fall of that wicket, the new batter comes out to the crease. They're quick to take guard and face up. Yeah, yeah. Balls in. And they're away and nicely off the mark. There'll be runs here. A little flick of the wrist to get it round the corner for an easy run. Three added in that over. New Zealand are 51 for three. it let's see if they can get the ball up into the slot like before so crucial to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure yes I for one reckon that second run was on but clearly the batters knew better They'll get at least one. Good running. It needed to be as well. Probably closer than they expected. There'll be one run here for them. Tucked it nicely into the gap. Pick up a single, red tape the strike. Yes. Lovely timing. Will this one go to the fence? Misjudged that throw and the batter survived what would have been a certain run out. Really raced between the wickets after it was clipped away nicely behind square. That sees the completion of the over. A good one too. Not many opportunities to score. Yep. 
Huge edge. Brilliant bowling. Having got the edge the previous ball, they now know the areas they need to be hitting. White. Finds the fielder with that shot. Maybe they didn't pick that up very late on the shot. Yes. Super shot. Paper. Good throw from the deep. Bang on target. Well, that was just a little bit wide. Well picked up, let the ball do all the work, really, to ease it down towards third. Yes. Head over the ball, great shot, that's racing away. Well, that's textbook perfect. A lovely drive through the covers. No need for the fielders to chase that one. That's the over. New Zealand are 68 for three. Very quick out there, managing to stop it and preventing four runs. Got forward well and was able to drive the ball. A lovely shot and good running. Wait on. Yes. They've picked the gap. Perfect timing. There's a run here, surely. There's a chance if this hits. Could that be out? Yeah! Looks so. They will receive now the warmest of receptions from this crowd for a supreme display of batting. And with that wicket, we'll see a change out in the middle. Nisham, whose first task is getting themselves settled. Lighting. A little late on that, no run scored. Doesn't beat the infield. Yep. Well placed, should get a single. 
four runs added in the over. New Zealand are 72 for four. Marsh into the attack now in the Randwick end. Oh my, that's racing away. That ball was just an invitation that was accepted by return of post. Marsh will be disappointed with that delivery. A boundary off the last ball. Is it a sign they're trying to push the run rate? Nisham takes guard, been in pretty good touch lately. You wouldn't want to let them get away early with some easy boundaries. Yep. Immediately underway with some runs. Great shot through the gap. Well, that was a really solid shot. Read the length early to get onto the front foot, and that raced away for four. They shouldn't get too discouraged with that last ball. The first step as a bowler is to get the batter playing, which they've managed. If they can find the right spot, the reward will eventually come. A bit of frustration after that shot, went after it, but just couldn't lay a bat on it. Yes. Ease through the field, there'll be runs here. Cummins from the Paddington end. Good short ball. Really lifted on its way through to the keeper. It was well played to let it go by. That's the last short ball for this over. It was just a little bit wide, well picked up and guided nicely down towards third. Yep. They'll push hard, should get back for two. A couple on offer here. That was good, patient batting. Just waited for it and got it easily down to third. Yes. That was a solid shot, driven off the front foot. Fantastic cricket shot. Probably deserved more from it. That's right out of the middle of the bat. You can't fault that shot. Nicely played and it was four runs all the way. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have been really happy with that last shot. Waiting. Can't get that outside the ring field. Yep. 
10 runs added in that over. New Zealand a 93 for four. Exquisitely down the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive, could have been worth more. Decisive running might have gotten to. Uh, looking back at it, I'd say they'd have made it easily, so in the end, poor running. Yep. Power and precision in that shot. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Yep. They'd look for a couple here. A brilliant throw in from the deep caps off what was a fabulous piece of fielding. End of the over, eight off it. New Zealand are 101 for four. Richardson, the pace bowler, coming into the attack. Thought it got past them, but a fantastic dive to cut it off. Just threw the shot too early. A wonderful delivery to get the edge. You've got to keep hammering away at that spot time and again. Yep. Got hold of it. A pretty good bouncer. Enough control to get it away. Good throw from the deep, on target. Surprised they didn't go for a third, would have been a very simple run. Yes! Onto the front foot, super shot, should be four. Good precision with the throw, back from the deep. Yeah, yeah. Not taken, a boundary, but not a convincing one. Always difficult to focus after what happened last ball, but you just got to stay positive and believe the wicket will come. Yep. Great shot, at least one on offer.
10 runs added there. New Zealand are 111 for four. Drives and misses everything. Totally beaten by the change of pace on that delivery. Very unlucky not to take the wicket. Cuts that off well in the infield. Chapman will be frustrated with that shot. The ball was there to hit, but couldn't find the gap. Yeah, yeah. Onto the front foot and punched it nicely. Would have hoped to find the rope. Great innings coming to an end. Brilliant scoring. It was a very entertaining performance, but has to head back to the pavilion. A big opportunity. They've worked hard in recent weeks. They should have the confidence to build an innings and get big runs on the board. Yes. There'll be runs here. Got forward and was able to drive the ball. Lovely shot and good running. A change to the complexion of this match. Got to get the new batter coming forward early, encouraging them to drive and really attack the stumps. Yep. Nice shot, runs possible. Easy does it. First ball and get some runs. Four runs added there. New Zealand are 115 for five. Yep. Quick onto that in the infield. Good shot, a beauty. The fielder could only pick that up off the boundary rope. Punched that away through the covers with exquisite timing. Finch, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. Yep. You can't fault that shot. Nicely played and it was four runs all the way. Boundaries are flowing. They need to find a dot ball or two to slow things down again. Yeah, yeah. Brilliant shot, that. Nothing really wrong with the delivery. Got onto the front foot and found the space to get that one to the boundary. Nisham has got the big shot away this over. Now they can focus on playing the next ball on its merits. Wait. Incredible, yeah, yeah. what a grab. They've played the most brilliant innings here, which could well have turned this match around. It's certainly entertained this crowd, who's loved every minute of it.
Sodi comes out to bat in a bit of form, but it'll be interesting to see how they go today. Oh, there you go, a no ball. Maybe just trying a little too hard. Just need to get more control back. Always looking to cash in on a free hit. Up to the bowler to come up with something to prevent it happening. Yep. Just about time that perfectly. There'll be one run here for them. And they're away and nicely off the mark. Richardson getting a wicket in that over. Really great bowling. There wasn't much on offer to the batters. Wow, that's missed a lot. Going, Misses out there on the short and wide one. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. No runs on that occasion, got into position nicely, just too early on the shot. Couldn't find a gap. Yes. They'll get at least one. Good return, back from the deep. Nicked it. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great last ball to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Yep. Edged. Let's see if they can get the ball up into the slot like before. So crucial to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Yep. Struck it nicely, could go to the boundary. Keeper. Good return there, back from the deep. Did well just to get it down towards third for some runs. End of the over, six runs coming from it. New Zealand, 136 for six. Stoinis coming into the attack from the Paddington end. Yep. Nicked it through the field. Will it get to the boundary? Well, it didn't time that at all, but managed to get it away to the boundary. It can be very disheartening seeing good deliveries smacked around. Sometimes you've just got to accept it and move on. Yep. Got forward and was able to drive the ball. Lovely shot, good running. on the drive areas, buddy. tried to get the drive away but timed it poorly lucky to survive yep chance huge nick but no one to catch it Ers on the side of bowling slightly fuller and they've been put away Brilliant bowling, having got the edge the previous ball, 
They now know the areas they need to be hitting. Edged it. Just threw the shot too early. They certainly don't feel like they've got anything on that, but almost every fielder is asking the question. Super catch. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. A lot of pressure coming to the crease. Not had the best of weeks leading up to this game, and will want to show everyone their strength. Stark, the left arm pace bowler, is coming into the attack from the Randwick end. Winning. Doesn't beat the infield. A little late on that, no run scored. That's mistimed, it's gone high, should be gone. Gone, yes! excellent catch, close to the bat. Another one, eight wickets gone, you feel it's just a matter of time now. A few decent deliveries could see the end. Saudi takes guard, been in pretty good touch lately. You wouldn't want to let them get away early with some easy boundaries. Yes. That's great fielding, that ball was flying. Immediately underway with some runs. Yeah, yeah. Lovely timing. Will this one go to the fence? Well, you never knew which way this game was going. A great finish to a super match that had everything. From all of us in the commentary team, I hope you've enjoyed the match. It ended up being very close. Hope to see you soon.